Okay, hello ladies and gents. Jumping into another Kaldheim ranked draft. We hit Diamond yesterday and we're aiming for Mythic. If you want to see the road to Mythic, please hit that subscribe button. There will be a lot of sweet drafts coming in the future. And look what we've opened. A good old Valky slash Tybalt. A beautiful open. Love to see that. Um, yeah, I mean, Inga's good. But, I mean, taking the Valky, of course. Okay, here. Got a couple picks that we could choose. There's a Rootless U, which I don't think is the pick. Basalt Ravager is good. There's a Rune Immortality. I think it's between the Rune and the Sinkhole for me. Hmm. Yeah, I think I'm going to take the sinkhole. Try and stay open. Have some fun. Okay, there's a Draugr's Helm. There's a th Rhymewood Falls. I think I might just take this Draugr's Helm. I like the idea of staying open, trying to do like maybe some five color fun, but it's hard to pass up a great black card like the Helm. Okay. Well, now we got to go somewhere outside of our colors, I'd assume. We can take the Cavalry, just try and do like a black-red Berserker deck. Which I wouldn't be against. It's also a Sculptor of Winter that I'm kind of eyeballing here. But maybe I will take the Cavalry. Okay. There's a Frostbite. Doomscar Titan. I think those are probably the two picks for me. Frostbite's good. Doomscar Titan is a card that you really want in like an aggro, um, like curve out Berserker deck. I think I like just taking the frostbite, it's a bit safer. Good card. Okay, snow covered mountain here. There's also a death knell berserker and a gold vein pick. Hmm, I do like berserker. Hard passing a snow covered mountain after taking the frostbite, though. I'm gonna take the berserker. Okay. Kind of just looks like a weak pack overall. There is a Berg Strider, which is easily the best card in this pack. Might just take the squash or maybe the skull raid. Yeah, I'll take the Skull Raid. Ooh, Curter's Vicious Return? Ooh, there's also a Craven Hulk. I think I'll take the Curter's. I'm not huge on this card, but I think it is probably better than just 4 mana 4-4. Four, four. Okay, another Berserker and a Firewalker. Which one do I pick here? 
think you could take either of these and be pretty happy. I think I'll take the Firewalker, though. There's a lot of boast synergies in uh, Black Red. Take another Cavalry. And another Firewalker. All right. This is, uh, this is looking pretty nice so far. Longbow. Hey, and we wield the Titan. That's beautiful. Breakneck Berserker is playable, but... Certainly would be a card I would... There's a lot of cards I'd play over it. Hey, Poison the Cup. Like that. Like that a lot. Don't care about Yorn. Not what we're doing. It's a Raider and a Disciple, but... Yeah, just taking Poison here pretty easy. The Valk- Whoa, Emmersturm Predator? Heck yes. Love that. I mean, I'd be very happy with a hammer too, but... Oh man, get in. I was gonna say, the front side of Valky is alright. But very weak to removal. It's this card you very much want to hold on to for the Tibalt side as much as possible, but sometimes you just gotta play Valky, and sometimes it's good. I think I had a game where I Valkyed taking, like, someone's uh, Braggart and then kind of went off with it. Okay. Not a lot of picks here for us. There's a Dusk Wielder and there's a Hoggy Mob. I guess I'll take the mob because Dusk Wielder has a pretty high chance of wheeling. I don't mind playing a one, a Dusk Wielder in this kind of deck. Especially a deck that has a lot of boast synergies, but I'll take the Hoggy. Ooh, lots of good picks for us here. I like Crown a lot. I don't think I'm picking it over any of these other cards since we don't have a rune yet. But there's a Mire, there's a Helm, Pup is alright, there's a Feed the Serpent. Okay, I think I might take Tormentor's Helm. Gosh, but Tormentor's Helm wheels pretty often. Maybe Meyer's just better. It's also hard passing a feed. Maybe I should just take that. It's better than Skull Raid. Yeah, I'll take a feed, and then any of these three bottom cards, I'd be very happy to wheel. Ooh, Frenzied Raider. That's nice. Already got two Firewalkers and a Hoggy Mob. Almost certain to get more. It's a solid two drop. Curter. Man, we're just getting everything. Beautiful. Beautiful. Another Frenzied Raider? Don't mind if I do. Okay, so there's another Cavalry, but that's probably a no for me. I think I'm going to go for the Pup, because now we have a lot of boast synergies. And this guy, he holds uh, equipment pretty well. Speaking of equipment, I don't know if this is equipment I'm looking to play. I wonder if I should just take the Raider. I'll take the Raider. Okay, wield the Hoggy. Don't know how excited I am to have this many 5 drops, so we'll probably end up cutting one. You really want this kind of deck to be low to the ground, low curve. So I probably won't play two Hoggy mobs, but we'll see. All right, nice, wield the helm. Seize the spoils.
All right, so really all we're looking for in pack three is just some like demon bolts are very high on our priority list. Damn, bunch of red cards, no demon bolt. There's another poison in the cup though. Man, Starnheim Unleashed. I think this is the second or third time I've opened this pack three. It sucks, but we're gonna be passing it. I'm just taking the poison. And being pretty happy about it. A lot of cards we can wheel in this pack too. Kennel Master, Craven Hulk, Run Amuck, and Provoke the Trolls, all nice wheels. Okay. It's a frostbite. It's not demon bolt, but it's something. I don't think we start taking snowlands here. I think it's too late for that. I think I'm just taking frostbite as a shock. Yeah. Hmm. Not much here for us either. Recruiter's not what we're trying to do. Could play Wither Crown. Don't think I'm playing Squash. I think Wither Crown's probably the most likely to be played out of all those cards. Second Curter versus Craven Hulk. I guess I just take him. They are legendary, so gotta watch out for that, but he's just such a strong card. I don't think I can pass it. Lots of goodies here. I think I'm taking one of these one drops. We already have a lot of four drops that are better than Craven Hulk. Just trying to think if I'd rather have a creature that holds equipment more or a creature that boasts more easily. Probably the first striker. Actually, no, I'm going to take the dusk wielder. Hey, there's a demon bolt. Nice. I was excited over the firewalker, but yeah, we'll just take a demon bolt easy. Second helm is cool. Another vicious return. I don't think we play two of these. I'll take the dual strike. Kind of like playing one run amok too. It's pretty sweet. It better than provoke the trolls probably already have a lot of four drop removal two poisons there's another pup as well and i think now that i have two helms two pups is probably better than two dusk wielders Might even cut the curters now. I like this deck a lot. I have quite a few cuts to make though. I think Berserker is probably one of our worst creatures. I wonder if I play this Helm. I guess I do.
Okay, so we're at 17 creatures, so I can maybe cut one creature, but... I think I cut a frostbite. Kind of thinking about pitching this Draugr's Helm. It just seems a little too slow for me. Four to equip is pretty hefty cost. Though, pups do hold it pretty well. Maybe I cut this raider. I wonder if I can do 16 lands in this deck. Seems a little greedy. Could do 17 lands, 41 cards. You know me, I don't mind a 41 card deck. 16 creatures, 8 non-creatures. As far as removal goes, we have Serpent, 2 Poisons, and a Demon Bolt. And then Run Amuck is kind of removal. I'm just trying to think if I can cut this Frostbite. But I think having 1 Shock is fine. Yeah, I'm just going to run 41. I don't care. Jumping into game one. Oh god, I'm fighting knowledge. Oof. Oh god. I think I'm gonna mole. I've got one playable card in my hand. This is much better. I guess I'll pitch the curter. Maybe I just pitch the one drop. I think I like that more. It's like, yeah, no one drop, but I'm willing to make that sacrifice for a, a nicer curve that's a bit higher. Double Firewalker. If we don't draw this fourth land, I'm going to be salty about pitching that one drop, though. Smack in for three. Bind, sure thing. Demon Bolt. Yep. Alright. Opponent's definitely got the stuff. Spirit. An 04. Oh boy, here I go flooding.
we draw even just one more land. Oh, that's bad. If we draw one more land, we probably just lose. Maybe I do need to go down the 16 lands. No way, does he have- he has another demon bolt. Oh, no he doesn't, thank god. <laughs> Alright, let's see what OP has. Got all the lands in the world. Another squash. Gross. Opponent has quite the slew of removal. Cinderheart Giant. Oh my goodness. Good gracious. Yikes. Big yikes. Alright, going down the 16 lanes it is then. Ugh. Flooded out. I'm a little scared of going down the 16 just because that makes Valky a lot harder to get the 7, but for the Tibalt. But oh well, going down the 16, don't want to flood out again. Man, I have to mole again. Oh, God. All right, here we go. Man, which one of these black cards am I pitching? Probably Valky. That sucks.
Come on, swamp. Give it to me. For the love of God. Please. Swamp one time. Oh, thank God. And I have no cards in hand. I hate having the mole again. Punch just gonna have another demon bolt and I lose. Dwarven reinforcements, okay. Raptor, okay. Yikes. Oh, you know Curter is going to put two helmets on. Oh, he's got a helmet of his own. Everybody's putting on helmets. Dragon showdown. Holy smokes. He's drawing cards. Berserker, Shield Mate. Oh, good, another mountain. Double helmet. We can play two dudes. I technically could have had lethal there. Um, yeah, I don't know why I didn't. I was too afraid. I don't know. I don't think there's anything you could have had with one red, but.
One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. That's fine. Oh man, he was one off lethal. Yowza. Yowza. Okay, I almost died. I should have just went for lethal. I don't... I'm so stupid. Alright, I need to get my head in the game. Actually, no reason for me to have not killed the flyer. Banging for seven to kill him. Give me a couple lands. Let's curve out. I was going to play the Frenzied Raider. Um, but now that I drew the helm and not a land, I think I'll just go for the... Uh, Berserker holds the helm better. If I draw a land, I'll probably just play Firewalker. I guess we'll see what he does, but... Okay, now I'm thinking he has 5 damage to a tapped creature. Could also be Demon Bolt, but I guess if you didn't use either, it's probably not. Much more likely that it's Judgment than Demon Bolt, because I think he would have Demon Bolted the Firewalker. <sighs> Yay. Oh, good. That is one card that I can't really beat. Fun, fun, fun. And he's got the bind. Okay. Joke's on you, though. I've got two curters. He's stuck on three lands, so that's kind of our saving grace here, but still not feeling good. I think it's almost certainly deal 5 to a tapped creature. It really doesn't... Oh, wait. Yeah, I definitely go for it now. Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Choose the legendary permanent that you wish to keep. I'll keep this one. I'm in trouble. He's just going to deal five to my curator here with the judgment. And then he's got potentially four. Hopefully just three more mana to play with after that. Oh, he conceded. Thank God. Hey, beat Doomscar. All it took was our opponent to get mana screwed for a couple turns, but that was a wipeout of a Doomscar. Three for one. And I guess that wasn't Iron Judgment? Because, yeah, I was attacking for four there, and he would take one from the Curder. Well, not even, because he could have killed the Curder right there. So I guess it wasn't Iron Judgment. I don't know what that was.
Sorry about that. I had to mute for a second. My dogs were barking. But we back. Oh my gosh, there we go again. I think we're getting a package, so I'm going to mute again. Now we're back for realsies, I think, this time. I'm hoping I don't have to play uh, Valky here. I might do that just because I don't think I'm getting to 7 mana this game, but... Okay, I think I definitely am. Just because of the uh, invasion of the giants, too, I guess I'll get a little look-see at his hand. Also gets more damage on the board. What you got, friend? Hey, he's kind of got nothing going on. So we'll take the Kin Seekers. So he's got two lands and a Behold there. He's going to draw two cards, though. Demon Bolt was a nice draw. Hopefully we can just curve out with the Hoggy Mob next turn, though. Didn't... Oh, right. He's already passed the reveal phase. Let's see if he drew a giant. Guess he could go for, like, a draw spell, try and hit, like, a Craven Hulk. Oh, but Craven Hulk doesn't even block. Yeah, opponent's in trouble here. What? I guess he could get, like, an Agar... Trying to think of a giant that he could play and it would be able to block here. Or I guess that uh, Kin Seekers would work. Alright, opponent's dead. I guess I just foretell both of these. Like, I could just foretell the Demon Bolt and keep that up. Maybe that's better. Uh, no. Nah, I'm gonna do both. Anything he demon I can Demon Bolt on his turn, I can just do it on my turn. It's not really a big deal. Yep. Okie doke.
I'll keep this. So this one, this hand looks more like a hand where we do not play Valky early. We might still play him early, but uh, just gonna go for a frenzied raider here rather than the Fortel of the Cup. Okay, well, I think I might actually go for the Valky here now. Oh man, it's tough. Hmm, I've changed my mind. I'm gonna foretell the poison, keep Valky. I feel like against green white, taking a creature from his hand might be pretty good, but. You know what's also pretty good? Just playing a 7-drop Planeswalker that wins the game. I guess I should have attacked with the pup there first. No, because this is actually just kind of bad for me if he blocks. Like, yeah, I kill the wolf, but takes up my whole turn so I don't think you attack there there are most times I think you attack with the pup because they're probably not gonna block but rather just get down the curter there fall of the imposter huh Well, now I think I Valky. Getting the 7 seems unlikely. I'm just going to get something out of his hand, keep up poison. Let's take a look-see. So he does have a struggle, which is unfortunate. But we do have poison, so... Yeah, let's take that Glade Walker from him. Hit him for seven. So he has no other creatures in hand, right? It's got Skemfar, Crown. Yeah, seems sweet. To counter on nothing, so Curter will die on our next turn, but that's all right. Okay, he's just going to concede. Nice, easy wins, baby. Easy wins. I'm telling you, you can draft all the five color decks you want, but half the time, not going to work. If you draft a solid tempo aggro deck, you're going to get a lot of wins. Going to get a lot of wins. I've been hearing people spewing a lot of hate on Valky, too. I was watching the new Mott stream the other day. People were like, oh, Valky isn't even good. The card's only good if you can Tibalt. It's not true. It's like a delayed hostage taker. You could even make the argument that it's a faster hostage taker since you don't. opponent doesn't even have to play the card. You just take it straight from their hand. I'm not even going to let you get the chance to play this before I hostage take her. I'm just going to take it now. Ballistic Warhawk. Okay. A little awkward, but yeah, I'll keep. Good draw. Okay. 
That is a trade that is a okay with me. I'm going to foretell the Demon Bolt. We really need to draw a land here. So I'm going to try and uh, set up, hopefully, either a Valky or a Frenzied Raider next turn, keeping up Demon Bolt. Draugr's... Ooh, wow, an empty Draugr's home. All right. And we did not get it. I think I'm going to Valky now. See what's in his hand. What's going on in there. Whoa. I think I take the Braggart. He's two turns away from a Furia. Next turn, he either plays a 3-drop or equips the helm if he draws a land. We've got a lot of removal. We just need to draw lands. Okay, so he does get the land. And he is going to go for a Draugr's home. Alright. I will take 3. Land. Oh, God, no! Well, I think I'm foretelling a poison the cup now. <sighs> Maybe he draws a land, just slams the furia. That'd be nice. And I'm pretty much just gonna like poison almost whatever he plays, probably. Oh, that's also very good. Taking five here? Gross. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. So fourteen cards. I have two lands. Oh, I'm in trouble. I mean, what can you do? There's nothing you can do. Taking four. Hey, I drew a land. I mean, we would like almost win this game if I had been able to demon bolt his reaper in response to the equip. Going to three. Stopping on my upkeep again.
Really hoping he doesn't draw a land. If he can go two, three drops this turn, I'm kind of just screwed. Yep. Okay, now we're banking on him just equipping this turn. Oh no! Okay, well that's bad. I'm so dead. I'm so dead. Okay, so we didn't equip. That is very interesting. Still interesting. Whole lots of mills going on. Uh, what? don't think I should have won this game. But win is exactly what I'm going to do here. Wow. Yeah, I don't think I should have won that game. But opponent played pretty loose. I'm A-OK -okay with that. Tier 3, baby. Tier 3, let's go. Mythic, here we come. Come on, I want to play more games. Let's go. Hop to it. So I think we've drawn our dragon once. And he did win us the game. Narrowly, thanks to my terrible play, but... Come on, give me an opponent. Give me an opponent. Let me add him.
Sure. I just frostbite that. Do not want that to go off. Not the best use of our mana. It would have been nice to play a two drop there, but I can't really allow that to get the chance to go off. Three. Rude. No exile, please. No exile. No exile, Reno. Ah, exile, Reno. card <laughs> oh I'm gonna have to do so much more damage to him now bloodline pretender okay rally the ranks for warrior I assume all right all right all right I see you Okay, we play the land there because uh, I want to be able to Firewalker next turn and play a land if we exile a land. Ooh, making an angel kind of sucks. He'd be dead if it weren't for that for that dang enchantment. Alright, so he makes an angel here. I don't think he can do really anything else after that. He'll have two mana. Hopefully he can't do anything else after that. Oh, he can. A 1-1. One, one. Boo. I mean, I think I'm just swinging out. He blocks the raider.
nice. Exactly what we were looking for. That or run amok, basically. Alright, that should be the game. Well, we managed to beat the shield. Thank God. That shield's busted. But we got lucky since... He was just playing a bunch of ravenous rats, which are not good against us. Our deck craves being hellbent. Push my deck into a corner, see how you like it. Well, if you got this far in the vid, and you want to see more drafts like this, hit that subscribe button. There's going to be so many drafts coming out. So many. If you want to see it live, head on over to twitch.tv. I'm live streaming all this. I'm I'm live streaming this. Why are you here? Why are you here looking with me? So you can berate me whenever I miss lethal or, you know, fun chat stuff. But yeah, if you want to see me live, head on over to twitch.tv. Log, log, login. And subscribe. Hit that bell notification. Helps me out a lot. But here we go. Not quite final boss, but it could be final boss. Hmm? Going for seven wins? Can we go seven and one? Clark rank, bro. Keep. I mean, it's not a good hand, but it's a keep. He can't block, because we can, uh, both of our creatures get out of reach when we, um, boast the pup. Pup number two. Get a poison online. So we could have a fight spell, which would kind of suck, but not even that bad. And he has to use it here, because from here on out, we're basically going to be keeping up poison. Especially against a black-green deck. Yeah, I'm, I'm thinking he's probably... Oh, yeah, he's got a struggle, doesn't he? Oh, no struggle? If he had struggle, he would have used that first. Plus four, plus four? Plus four, plus four. Wow. Aggro. Debating on whether if I want to keep up poison or play the berserker. Hmm. He doesn't have struggle for told. I think I'm just gonna go for the berserker. Put more damage on the board. If he has struggle, he has struggle. Shrug, I guess. We're gonna do what we can here. So, funny enough, I think land is probably our best draw. I mean, we'll see what he plays, but... Wither Crown on the Berserker, sure. And a way down, sure. He's swinging in. Be aggressive. Be, be, 
aggressive. Yeah, I'm gonna have to sack it. Feed does nothing. Equip a pup. Neither of these are very good, I don't think. Elder Leaf Mentor, okay. Yeah, I'm going to attack. Man, this guy is hyper... Hyper aggressive black green. It's weird. Alright, if we draw a land, we win. Hey. Good game. Oof, that's seven wins, baby. Hit that subscribe button. There's more. All right, we're going to hit Mythic this season, you hear? Hit that sub button. But that'll be it. Thanks for watching, everyone. Um, Man, what a sweet draft. Head on over to the to the Twitch, man. We're having a good time over here. Bing bong, bing bong. Six packs. Oh, do we got some packs to open? Oh, always open them in tens. Never open them unless you have ten. No mythics? Rigged. Alright, thanks for watching, everyone. Bye-bye.